we are at Molyneux for the 2021 Sleep Out. We are going to be sleeping here in the Stan Carlis Stand this evening to raise vital funds in aid of homelessness and food poverty in the city of Wolverhampton. Why are fundraising events like this so important? I think, you know, the charity and the foundation are here to make an impact in Wolverhampton. That's what all the our, our, our part of the fund from tonight will go towards and it's for all the 38 different projects which the foundation run to have 38 different aims and 38 different positive impacts that we can have and to be partnered with the Good Shepherd on an event like tonight and it's yeah it's just an amazing thing to do so again it's just really positive and just again thank you everyone for joining us because I hope we can make a big difference. Well I came to the the last one that we had it, it here at Molyneux in, in 2019 uh, and I was really keen to do it again this time around. I think it's a, a fantastic um, thing for the club to be doing and the foundation um, to be staging it obviously in partnership with the Good Shepherd. Um, it's a really humbling experience, it was last time, I'm sure it will be again uh, this evening um, and it's just great to sort of mix with staff and fans and ex-players and guys from the media and um, all come together for a, a fantastic cause. Over the last few years we've started to, you know, well we all know we've integrated into the club and, and along with that has come responsibilities of, of starting to give a little bit back. You know, we've we've done really fantastic over the last few years out of Wolves and, and we as a, a group of people want to want to help out to promote the likes of, of this event and you know we've been out there with the feed our pack stuff over the last few years and, and we see just how hard Wolverhampton's hit with this kind of stuff. So um, yeah, as soon as we got the opportunity to come down and support however we could, we were we were all over it. Well, I think it's uh, after the year that we've had and not been able to do it properly last year. Um, I think when I saw it a couple of years ago and people doing their bit, raising money for charity, I just really wanted to support the event and you know increase the popularity of it by helping to promote it myself and try and raise some more money. How many layers have we got with you this evening, Johnny? What, what have you brought with you to keep warm? I've got quite a few layers. I've got about four or five that I'll be wearing, plus there's two sleeping bags. I'm not blessed with a lot of natural body fat, so I've got to make the most of it uh, and bring as much layers as possible. Carl, as an ambassador for the Good Shepherd, why is this such an important event to, to fundraise for? Um, obviously, it brings everyone together in the community again, um, raises awareness and, and funds which are always needed and um, they always get used well, I think that's the, the main thing. I think I've been involved with, with Wolves, for obviously, for, for most of my life. Um, I've seen what the foundation's done, done since I was here. They're always involved in, in key areas in the city and for the community, again, to, to, to come together to, to try and help. I don't know if you ever eradicate it, but they, they, there's always better ways, a better, better method to do things, and that's what the foundation are doing, that's what the Good Shepherd are doing, trying to find better ways uh, and trying to help more people that are falling on the hard times. We've gone an awful long way in Wolverhampton to try and get people off the streets. Uh, we're very proud to say as a city we've offered every single homeless person a place and support services. That's vitally important, not just a roof, support as well. Um, however, there's always more to be done, so we keep going. That's why we're very grateful for people here today raising those funds. We're also keeping the awareness. We're not there yet, we'll keep going. Everyone deserves a roof above the head. Wolverhampton is a proud city and we will provide that. I'm an ex heroin addict. I got a place through Housing First, um, which basically changed my life because it gave me some you know, structure in my life, and, you know, a safe haven, because obviously being on the street is dangerous. Um, uh, I'm clean now for one year. Um, I set goals. Thank you. Thank you like, that for really having me and the walls and everything and I really appreciate it and um, this work that everyone here is doing is, is just amazing honestly so really everyone needs to tap themselves on the back because you know you've really done something amazing coming here tonight and doing this. I think I'm always blown away with walls with the community in Wolverhampton when people get together and it's usually the people who've got the least you'll be amazed come Christmas time people will come up and, and they'll donate what little they've got to support whether that's food or financial. So I think it just symbolises really the people of Wolverhampton coming together to support two great charities in the city. Thank you both so, so much for joining us this evening. And thank you to all of you for being here as well. Hopefully.
those words really do show just why we're doing this tonight. So thank you both so, so much. Thank you.